So in this video, I'm going to show you how to add a camera through a PoE switch using the PoE ports on the back of the NVR. What does that mean? I've got my NVR here and it has PoE ports built into it. You see where that black cable is going? Those are PoE ports that are grouped together and it says PoE ports right next to it. So this is a 16 channel NVR with eight PoE ports, but I'm trying to add the, uh, some cameras off of another PoE switch that's at a distance farther away. So I've got this black cable going from the back of the NVR going into my PoE switch. So I've got a uplink port right here. It's blinking green. That's my uplink port that tells me my PoE switch is connected to my NVR's PoE ports. And then I've got this red cable connected. Again, blinking lights on it. It's blinking because it's showing me that it's connected to my camera right here in the box. So if for some reason, when you're doing this, your camera doesn't connect as I have here, here's what you need to do. First, disconnect all the cameras from the back of the NVR. I just did that right now. Disconnect my cable. Go to the main menu. It may ask you to log in, put in your password. Go into system, default. I'm gonna default only certain settings. Uncheck all, hit camera, network, and do apply. This will reset settings for cameras and networks. Hit okay. The system will reboot. I'm gonna pick up on the video after it reboots. Now my NVR has rebooted. So where do I stand right now? I've got my camera still connected to my PoE switch, but see there's no light here. That's because the switch is no longer connected to the NVR. So I'm gonna log in. It's asking me to log in, so I'll put in my password. Now, as you can see, there are no cameras connected. The first thing I'm gonna do is connect my NVR into the port. In this case, I'm connecting it to the eighth port right here. Once I connected it, it starts blinking green and I just keep looking at my screen and let's see what happens. And there you go, I've got video. Thanks for watching.